kissing a picture of her husband. Nadine, along with thousands of others, bid farewell to rugby legend Jonah Lomu. In an emotional yet vibrant service at Eden Park in Auckland, the rugby legend was honoured with a colourful display and emotional tributes. Widely considered as rugby's first global superstar, Lomu died unexpectedly of a cardiac arrest on the 18th of November. He had suffered from a kidney disease for two decades and was awaiting a second transplant after having one in 2004. The public service at the ground where the strapping rugby ace thundered down the touchlines was where his compatriots paid their respects before a private funeral service later this week. Many of the tributes honoured how the Tongan star became a role model and ambassador for children of Pacific Island descent in South Auckland. Students from Lomi's primary school wrote and performed a song for the legend and man that did so much for the Pacifica community. Jonah, you were many things to many people. You were a freak on the field and a gentle, caring giant off it. A loving husband, dad, son, and brother. But most of all, you were a lovely, lovely man. In a final symbolic display, Lomu's former teammates carried his coffin past members of the Maori and Tongan community as students from his former high school performed the haka, uniting the pockets of society that his influence touched and continues to.